Hey guys, welcome back. Forgive the crazy hair, but I just got back from shopping at our local um, Amazon bin store. And so they restock on Thursday night. So on Fridays, every item in the bin is $12. Um, Saturday, every item is 10, Sunday is eight, Monday is six, Tuesday is five, Wednesday is three, and Thursday is one. Well, I went on Tuesday and got some of the $5 stuff, and then I went yesterday and got some of the $3 stuff. Then I went today, and I'm thinking, you know, oh my God, this hair. I'm thinking, mm, there's not going to be much there for me to get because everything's picked through by Thursday. Guys. I about couldn't get it all in my car and let me tell you I spent $85 today is what I spent so I am going to attempt to show you all of the stuff that I got I don't know this is probably going to be a long video so one of the things that I picked up and so what this the deal is it's um, stuff that's all it's all new and in packages still um, a lot of the stuff you can't see what's in the package but there's like a barcode on it and if you scan that barcode with your Amazon app, most of the time it'll bring up what is in the package. And, but you have to read the dis little description on the barcode and make sure that it matches. So some of it's a gamble. Um, but I did pick up this bicycle helmet. One dollar. Yep. Um, I'm going to show you some of the larger items that I got first. I should have brought some scissors out here. Okay, so this, um, I actually picked up um, two of these yesterday, and I paid $3 for them, um, but I seen them today for a dollar, and so I grabbed another set, and so what this is, it's four pieces. Now, mind you, I paid a dollar for this, and it is the wall, um, wall art, so you make a like a collage on your wall with this and so it's the four pieces so I got four canvas prints for one dollar so I told my kids you know don't be surprised when your Christmas gifts come from the Amazon bin store this year because that's probably what's going to happen um, now this uh, I got stuff falling guys because when I tell y'all I got so much stuff it's not even funny this one no this one is different this one there was two different ones let me go grab a knife or scissors and i will be right back okay guys i am back i just run in and grabbed a knife because that was the closest thing to me and so i'm just opening up this other set of art prints i don't know if it's the same like i got yesterday okay yes and it looks like it is so it is like a beachy fishing type scene so you would put all four of these prints together and make a beautiful um, collection on your wall one dollar i thought i got a good deal yesterday when i got it for three dollars wow um this one I'm not sure. It says Rosecraft 18-inch Christmas wall ornaments, but then it says 800 pieces. So this is one I honestly have no idea what I got. So we will see. Oh, wow. I got a wreath. Check it out. Look at that. I paid a dollar for that. It needs to be glued back on, but look. Hi, I'm excited about that. One dollar. And I can, you know, add stuff to it and really fancy it up, but huh. Gosh, y'all know wreaths are expensive. All right, let's see if the other one is the same. Probably because it says the same thing on the outside. So I don't know. And this was one I didn't even bother to look on the Amazon app. Honestly, today I didn't look at anything on the Amazon app because I figured the stuff, it's a dollar. So 
I couldn't go wrong. And yes, it is another wreath. That is wonderful. Oh, I'm very excited about that. Okay. So another thing I picked up was this copper baking mat. And y'all know I will not use it for my baking. I will probably end up using this in my um, craft studio. But it was one dollar. So it's a non-stick mat. Okay. Then uh, stuff is falling, guys. Okay. One, two, three, four. So I picked up four of these. Are four packages. I don't know what else in it. I think it's just one bag in each package. But let's just open it and see. Yes, so this is a very nice canvas tote bag. Wow. Look at that. It has a $30 price tag on it. I paid a dollar for it. That'll be great for like um, journaling supplies or craft supplies or anything like that. So I got four of those today. Now this one, I have no idea what this was. It says find and seek toy. It has a $17 price tag on it. Oh, that's cute. Okay, so my little naked baby's going to enjoy that. So it is some kind of like a dog toy or cat toy. Yes. So it says, better toys for pups, people, and the planet. So I'm just trying to see what it says. So it's got the crinkle. So it's like a little tent with the sleeping bags. And it's got the squeaky things in it. They, they are going to love that. And again, that was one that I got. I had no idea what it was because, but I figured for a dollar, I can't go wrong. All right. And then I picked up this. It says this is a large, so this will not fit my naked baby, but this will probably fit the little Dotson. I got her a little Christmas dress. How cute is that? She may not love it, but I do. And then today I picked up three of these and I was so hoping they had more because I bought one yesterday and this is what it looked like in the package and I really couldn't tell exactly what it was. Number one, I love the bag that it came in. It's just one of those larger organza bags, which I will be using that. And, you know, it's shrink wrapped in here. So when I got it yesterday, I'm like, I'm not so sure, you know. But again, yesterday it was $3. I figured it was worth it. It comes with a little card and it says best wishes and it folds. But guys, look at this. It is a plush blanket. And it's big, and it says Grandma, Nana, Mama, and it's huge. And I had got one yesterday, and when I opened it yesterday and took it out of the package, my dog, yeah, my little naked baby, she just immediately took to it and claimed it. So um, I paid $3 for the one yesterday. I paid a dollar a piece for these, and I found three of them. So I grabbed those. Now the next thing I got, and I'm hoping these maybe are different sizes, but if not, it's not a big deal. So I picked up one of these yesterday, and the quality is so good on these. I think this one's smaller. These are pet rain jackets. And guys, if y'all have ever, ch oh, I think this one's small enough to fit Dahlia. Yeah, I think it, this might fit Dahlia. If y'all have ever seen the prices of these, these things are insanely expensive. Um, on Amazon, these are listed for $50 a piece. 
guys I paid a dollar so I think this one will fit Dahlia and it is so nice it's got the little hood area and it velcros around them it's got the spot right here it's got a spot for their harness and it is a great um, raincoat and then you know my daughter has little dogs a couple of them so I picked up um, I actually got four today plus I have one from yesterday so I now have five of these and then this was just something to um, I grabbed three packs of this two of the silver and one of the blue and it is the tissue paper and so it says it's got 60 sheets of tissue paper in the silver and a hundred sheets in the blue and guys if y'all have ever bought tissue paper y'all know that's insanely expensive now this one is one that I am not real sure but I think it says flying paws dog cat blanket 40 by 30 and I ended up getting one two three four five six seven I got eight of these one in this cream colored and seven in a gray color because y'all know my naked baby has to have a blanket at all times oh she's going to be in love look at that wow look at that this will make a great backdrop for um, photos too oh and it's kind of shiny you can't really see maybe on the camera because of the way the sun's hitting me but it's very shiny she's not getting the white one because it will be brown by the time she gets done laying on it because of all the oils in her skin and I'm gonna just put it in this little organza bag for now and let's open one of the gray ones and look at it and so this is a great baby blanket which I need it for Dahlia because that cat has to have her um, blankets at all times so I picked oh and this one's shiny too so this one is a gray one Look at that. That will make really nice photo backdrops. Now this one doesn't seem as large as the other one, which it's fine for her. I wonder if, the, um, let me look at the sizes on them. So this one says 31 by 21. It says it's a medium. This one's a medium. Medium. Oh, this one's a big one. This one's a large, so let's see. I, I need to stay away from that store, and I, I made myself a promise today. I'm only going to go on dollar days because, yeah. Oh, yeah, look at that. Very nice. So I got large, large, large. So it looks like I only got maybe three mediums, which it don't matter for her. She'll like them all no matter what size they are. So there's those. Then I picked up this box and it says graduation paper tableware set, but it's paper plates. And guys, I don't care if it's graduation or not. A paper plate's a paper plate around my house. So it's um, a ton of paper plates. It's got the large ones, um, the small ones, and it came with napkins as well. And that was one dollar. Okay, so this I grabbed. It was not in the package, but I got some that were in the package. So these are like, um, maybe like a thin type blanket. And it said, I don't even know which way it goes. It's just like a fairy scene. And it's pretty good size. And again, it's not a thick plush blanket, but it's something, you know, that my naked baby will enjoy. So I got one, two, three of those. And then this, I want to say, is maybe the same... I guess these are some kind of a curtain this set is because it came with some kind of clips 
and again, I have no idea what they say or anything like that, but I figured um, for my cat, okay, so it's like a black Jesus or something. Yeah, it's like a black Jesus, which, you know, I'm good with because when you've got a cat like I do that has to have blankets, you can never have enough blankets. So there's that. I got two of those. Let me just get it back in the bag so I know what it is. I don't even know if that's the bag it came out of. I don't even care. Okay, and this was another one that I have no earthly idea what it is. I did not even see a um, tag on it to scan. But what I was looking at is that it is that plush. And so I knew whatever it was, it wouldn't matter because Dahlia will enjoy it. So it looks, I have no idea. It looks like maybe something that would zip together. I don't have a clue, guys. If y'all know what it is, let me know. But I know what it will be. It will be Dahlia's little bed. Okay, and then this was another one that it did not have anything on it saying what it is. But I could see that it was fabric. And so, you know, in journals and stuff, you can use fabric of any sort. So, I grabbed it. And let's see. Oh, it's a sheet. Is it a set? Yeah, it's a sheet set. Or maybe it's like a couch cover throw. I don't know. We'll have to figure that out. Because, yeah, it's maybe a twin sheet set. I don't know. But, you know, even if I don't use it as a sheet set, I like the fabric that it is. It's a beautiful fabric. Okay, what is this? This says Bermino Sheer Curtains. Did I get two of these, or are these different? Maybe these are different. And so again, even if I don't use the curtain, oh, these are nice curtains. So it looks like two panels, maybe? And it's that sheer. But even if I don't use it as the curtain that it is, I will use the fabric. Because there's no way I could have got that much fabric for a dollar. And y'all know I'm going to keep tell, reminding y'all that I only paid a dollar. Because that's what I do. Okay. And then this, what does this say? This says Soft Talker Rectangle 10 by 4 Camellia. Not a clue. This is a very thick fabric, whatever this is. Oh, it's pretty, whatever it is. Maybe... I wonder if it's a shower curtain. Wow, it's very pretty. So I'm not real sure what it is yet. Maybe a tablecloth? I think that's what it is, a nice large tablecloth. It's very pretty. I love it. That would make a pretty journal cover. How pretty would that be on a journal? It's probably what it's going to get used for, to be honest. I could get several journal covers out of that, as big as that is. Alright, this, this is a firewood carrier bag. Um, it is a canvas bag. And these things are expensive. So I grabbed this, and so what you do is you lay your firewood on it and then you just grab the handle and you pick it up and you tote it like that but this could also be used for your junk journal supplies anything like that I can use this um, if I'm toting stuff so it may not be used for a firewood carrier around my house although it could be because we do have a fireplace And then, I 
the next thing that I grabbed. Geometric pillow covers, sofa, office decor. Ooh, these are nice. These are very nice. So it's one, two, three, four of them. And these are for your square throw pillows. Look at that. Beautiful. But if I don't use them for pillows, I could use them for bags to store my um, 12 by 12 paper pads in. See, you got to think outside the box, guys. Yeah, that would be pretty cool. So I love those. They had a bunch of those. I should have got more. Because with that, the material that it is, that would make pretty journal covers too. Okay, next up is this huge mouse pad. It said it's a gaming pad, but it is a massive mouse pad. Look at that. So that is going to be great. I will put that to good use. In fact, I will be using that as soon as I get back in. All right. This was another thing. I have no idea what this is. I tried to read it. Oh, it says Galaxy Pencil Case. So I guess maybe that's just paper on the inside of it. Yeah, so it's just a pencil case. It was $1 though, so you know, not bad. I'm okay with that. It says $20 on the price tag. Uh, no, no way would I have paid $20 for that. I'm a little aggravated that I wasted one of my dollars on that, but oh well. Okay, then this, it said that it was five pieces soap savers. So it's like supposedly for your soap in the shower. I have no clue. Again, a lot of the stuff I bought because, oh, okay. So I guess you put your soap in. This will be good for Dahlia for bathing her. So you put your soap in there. And it has five of them in it. But I like the bag itself. Hmm. I'm thinking junk journal type stuff. Then I picked up this set of 24 pieces of the hair clips. You know, that go... Obviously, I should probably be using one some right now because my hair looks awful. Then I found these. And these are little gift bags. So they're like for weddings. And it has one two, three, six of them in there. So six gift bags. This was another thing that I had no idea um, what it was. It was in this bag. And let's see what it is. Oh, it's really nice. Um, it's three garment bags. Very nice garment bags. So that's great. Um, we have our cruise in January. And I think we have two formal dinners on the cruise because of how long the cruise is. So I, I want to say it's... I want to say it's th two, but... I'm not even going to try and put that back in there. It's taking too much time. And then this does not say what it is. I think it may... Oh, yeah. I bought one of these yesterday. So this goes on... This hooks on the back of the headrest, on the back seat of, like, my um, Enclave. And it is a trunk organizer. And it's great quality, it feels like. So I got one yesterday, um, and then I'll give that one to Victoria, my daughter that lives here. And then this says it's a woman's scarf, and I figured I might would need this with the way that it has been so cold. 
So, yeah, that was $1. It's soft. Wow, I like it. Okay. Now, this was another thing that I don't know what it is. And for some reason, I bought four of them, even though I didn't know what they were. And what does it say? It says, Joy Plus Simple Woman Something Art. Okay, so it's got the things that you can hang up again. So I guess maybe it's something that you could paint. Okay, so it's like a line art type thing. Oh, I like it. So this is the one side. So it's like the woman's face. So I guess you could paint it or something. But that is something that Dahlia will probably end up using as a blanket. And what I'll probably do is end up maybe cutting it and getting maybe like four out of each one. Because a lot of times when she uses something, especially if it's white, um, the oils on her skin, even though she gets a bath every single week, um, she ends up staining it. You know, and I don't mind her staining something that, you know, I only paid a dollar for. And then especially if I... Um, cut it apart and I get several uses out of it I'm good all right so this didn't have a tag on it but that whatever it is it came wrapped like this so let me I'm just going to cut it and I'm sorry you guys can probably hear chainsaws or something in the background okay so these are kitchen towels so I got one two three four and five got five of those I'm liking that this I picked one of these up yesterday and I um for my husband and I actually picked this one up today for my mother this was the only one I saw there left today but it's one of those um picker upper things I don't know what you call it grabber tools but it is a very nice one and so let me get the plastic off of it so as you can see, it folds up. Let me just get this plastic off. And it has a clip for when you fold it that it will stay in place. And then it just goes together just like that. And it's a very nice grabbing tool. So I picked that one up for my mother. Like I said, I'd got one for my husband yesterday. Um, and those things can be a little pricey. And then this one was another thing that I wasn't sure what it said. It said 15 pieces, modern something, 30 sheets each. And so when I got in the car, I opened it. And so these are sticky note pads. So it looks like it's 15 different ones. And it says, so proud of you. Anything is possible. No pain, no gain. You are amazing. Follow your heart. Good things are coming. I mean, so it's 15 different sticky notepads. So I figured it was worth it, you know. Well worth it for a dollar. And now let me just try and chunk them back down in here. <coughs> Sorry about that, guys. And I can feel myself like licking my lips and they're getting chapped because it's chilly out here. All right, then I grabbed um, two sets of these and these are silicone dome molds. And so each set has three in it, but what I am going to use it for will be for like my paints and for my um, Mod Podge. So it's just, it's three sets of our three in each thing. And so I got three of them for a dollar. Um, but I'll use these for any of my art stuff, like for my glues, my Mod Podge, whenever I'm working with it. And that way, um, all I have to do is just rinse it out because of it being the silicone and it's non-stick. So that will be good. Then I also picked these up. I got um, a pack of the. I got two more packs of these. I had got some of these um, 
I think I got some of these when it was the $5 day. But these are little muslin bags. And I thought these would be cute to include in a journal and put like some of the um, leftover um, scraps and ephemera and stuff. And with it being that muslin like that, I love the way that they look. And so I think there are 50 in each pack. So the other day I done 50 and I paid um, $5, which still was not bad. But today I got 50 and I paid $1, much better. So I got two packs of those today. Then I seen these, I'm not gonna open this out. It says that it's an adjustable curtain rod, 27 and a half inches. And it comes with all the brackets and everything where you can even just kind of stick it on the wall. And I found two of those. I will use these to hang my ribbon on. All right, then I grabbed, um, this is a pack, it says 12 pieces, Christmas, something, I don't know, so they're like Christmas gift boxes. So it comes with the little gift box that you can put together. And it comes with ribbon. And it comes with bags. Oh, so these are like for the money. You do the money, um, these are the money boxes. That's cool because this says pull here for surprise. So you do your $1 or $5 or whatever you're going to give somebody. And so you do it up in this little box and then when they pull it, ha, I love it. I done, um, a money box for my oldest grandson for his birthday and I made it out of a um, Kleenex box but that's cool and even though those are Christmas designs you can always collage over them or something and make them into like a birthday design I like that I'm excited about that very excited and so it's 12 different boxes and then I grabbed this. It says 48 pieces, Christmas decorations. So these are the Christmas bows. And there's 48 in here. And it looks like all different designs. So it's where you um, take them apart and it makes the pretty bows. I'm not going to open them up because y'all know what those are, I'm sure. So I got 48 bows for a dollar. Y'all know how expensive bows are? Yes, that's definitely exciting. Then I picked up one, two, four packs of these today. I did pick up one pack of these yesterday. And they're Christmas, but I don't care. I mean, I'll use them during Christmas, but there's no way I'll use all of these during Christmas. And what these are are little... Um, like cardboard type containers and I'll show you guys if I can get one out I should have just grabbed one out of the open pack in there but I didn't okay so I think it is how many's in here so it's 180 and so they come like this and oh I'm thinking you know what these could even be journal covers mm-hmm and so you just put it together. It's very easy to put together. You just fold the sides in and tuck the little thing in. I'm just doing this one real quick so you guys can get a better visual on what it is. There we go. And so it's these little um, containers here. And there was 180 in each set and I got two I got four today and so I got one yesterday so that gives me a total of five sets of them all right moving on I picked up two of these these are the um, double-headed curved highlighters so they have the different um 
like they have stars and hearts and lines and so it's one two three six seven eight nine so there's nine in each pack they're dual tip so I did get two sets of that Trying to find somewhere to put all this stuff. Okay, and then these, I picked up one of these yesterday. Actually, I picked up a couple of these yesterday. And the reason I got them, it, guys, look at that hair. I got them because, number one, they come with these cute little organza bags. And these cute little tags. But, guys, they are keychains. Look. And so my thought process was this. Even if I don't want to use, say, the animal keychains, I'll just cut that off and I'll use the, um, the hardware. And it says it's 90 pieces. So there's 90 keychains in there. 90 keychains, the tags, the, the bags. Or it might be 30. 30 keychains, 30 bags, and 30 tags. So... There's no way you can get that. So I, I got um, a couple of packs yesterday, and I, they were three dollars. And today I got four more packs. Okay, so let me move them out the way. Almost done, guys. All right, and this is another thing I I picked up um, one of these yesterday, and. It's supposed to be like some kind of kite hand birthday thing, like you fly it with your hand. But what I really wanted was the ribbon that was on it. And so it is 12 of these little things. And look at the ribbon. So each one has got all of that beautiful ribbon on it. Plus it has those little wooden... Um, circles. So my thing was the ribbon is why I got them. So that is a ton of ribbon to use for my spine dangles and that kind of stuff. So I got all of that for one dollar. So there's 12 sets in a box. And I got three today. All right, we're almost done. Like, literally, I think this is the last thing. This, I have no idea. It says 12 sets Christmas activity is all I could see. I see some double-sided tape. I see some pom-poms. Oh, my grandkids are going to have a fit. Foam stickers. More foam stickers more foam stickers and the wreath oh my goodness and the thing so apparently it is enough to make 12 christmas wreaths wow my grandbabies are going to be excited about that so it's that's 12 i think i don't know if they're all the same so we'll just kind of oh, i left the tape out I left the tape out And I'm thinking that's probably the same, but I don't know. Because, you know, sometimes they... So, yeah, that one is Christmas wreaths as well. Let's see what the other two... Because I got four sets today. Yep, that one's Christmas wreaths. And let's see. I'm sure this one is too. Yep. All right. So that's cool. I can do that with, um, like, mm, I can give some of those to the kids at the church because, um, my goodness, y'all, look. Don't look. Never mind. Um, because yesterday I also got some Christmas, um, like, gift bags. Um, I don't know. I got all kinds of stuff. But anyway, guys, all of that stuff that y'all saw was less than $90. So tell me what you guys think. Tell me what your favorite product was that I got today. And yeah, 
we'll do this again next Thursday. Bye, guys.